Hey guys, good morning. Welcome back to another video or welcome to my channel if you're new. My name is Abby and I make lifestyle vlogs. So if this is the type of content you like to watch, then please make sure you subscribe. It is currently Friday, so happy Friday. It is 8.04 in the morning. I know that clock says 8.05, that's a minute advanced. But yeah, usually I would just be starting work now, but I'm not working today. I haven't worked at all throughout this week, actually. Yeah, I just have a bit of an update to tell you guys. And that update is I moved apartments. Not anywhere far, it's still within like my building complex. So yeah, I was very excited. I wasn't supposed to start moving on Monday, but the agent gave me the keys Friday before that. So I had the weekend to pretty much move so we took advantage of that and Carl and I moved everything throughout the weekend and then I'm pretty much all settled in this place now I do still have the keys at the other place um, because my lease doesn't end until tomorrow for that place and I'm actually seeing the agent there later today to do an outgoing inspection this is my first time doing this my previous apartment I just kind of left and gave the keys to the agent um, and yeah, I don't know, maybe this is the process, I don't know, maybe it's different with like different real estate agents, but anyways, that is the deal. Yeah, I'm so happy with how the apartment has turned out. I'll give you guys a little tour when, um, yeah, when we have time. I am obviously still like, you know, trying to decorate here and there, but majority I'm pretty much happy with how things are and where things are, so I'm very excited for that. But yeah, I was pretty much free from Monday. And honestly, I could have gone back to work. But I didn't. I mean, you know, I've got the annual leave. So I just took it. I was thinking about just going back to work. So I don't use my annual leave. And I actually get to use my hours when things open up again. Because we are in lockdown. Anyways, whatever. So I wasn't actually planning on moving. But I like to look at units houses apartments all that stuff on real estate and when i found out that this was available i was like oh i'm gonna inspect it because you know it's literally just around the corner from my apartment so i came inspected it and i really really liked it i wasn't sure if i was going to apply for this apartment because like my lease for the other place um wasn't going to end for another i think two months so that's quite of a big gap anyways i still just you know applied anyways and for some reason it got approved so here i am now um which i'm very happy that i got approved because i definitely like this place better than the other place i'm pretty sure you guys will too when i show you so yeah that's pretty much the backstory of what happened and why i moved everyone i know was like what you moved again <laughs> i didn't tell my parents until Sunday. Yeah, I just took pictures of the place and I sent it to my mom and I was like, surprise, I moved. And not gonna lie, I was scared. I thought she was, I don't know. I, I don't know why I thought she was gonna be mad. Mom, if you're watching this, I don't know why. But anyways, that's all done now. They all know that I moved. So yeah, I just have a few things I need to do today and I thought I would just bring you guys along. If you guys enjoy this vlog, make sure you give this a like, subscribe. Oh, did you guys hear that truck? <laughs> Anyways, this is it for my makeup. All right, what's the time now? 8.20. The first thing I might do is actually finish this coffee and go pick up my click and collect order from Kmart. Oh my gosh, I just showed you a bit of my apartment, but I might as well just show you now. There's no point of me being dramatic so yes this is the place oh my freaking gosh it looks so much better than the other place don't you guys agree obviously i mostly have the same furnitures because we don't need to buy new ones okay let me run you through around the apartment so pretty much everything here is the same as the previous place nothing new my coffee table is new because my old one one of the legs actually broke off so i just got a round one this is just from kmart i'm going to link it below if you guys are interested this is not new i'm actually not vibing this and i'm looking for something else to put on top of the coffee table but we'll just leave it like that for now i'm so sorry about this lighting guys <laughs> the sun is just peeking through and then my old couch yeah i just have these three cushions 
these two are new i just got them from kmart and the other one the yellow one i can't remember look i've had that for so long and then my little diy i actually had it up there but it fell overnight um the actual strip on the frame came off i just need to fix that but a little bit later not right now and then yeah the kitchen this is like probably the biggest um improvement is that the word just looks so much better than the other place it's bigger if you remember the other place is literally just one side of the wall it didn't have the island bench so i'm very happy with this and then my dining area i sold my other table the white one if you guys remember and i got this round table instead just from facebook marketplace i didn't have to pay full price which is always great and yeah i just have the two wishbone chairs i got it from amart i was actually thinking of buying two more of the wishbone chairs just to have it all around the table but they're not cheap and i was like i can't really have more than one person here in my place because of the current lockdown yeah i think i'm just going to leave it like this all right so i'm gonna finish my coffee and then head to kmart to pick up my click and collect order they actually sent me the email quite early this morning like to say that it's ready for pickup they sent it at 4 47 a.m for anyone who works at kmart do you guys start this early like what <laughs> I didn't realize it was this heavy. <gasps> Holy moly, it is heavy and it's massive. I didn't think it was gonna be this big. Oh boy, hopefully it fits okay. Okay, let's make sure we sanitize. We don't want no COVID here. Woo. Wow, that was probably the quickest click and collect I've done. So good. So while I'm out, I might actually just post this. It's just a return that I need to do because I placed an order from Shein and there's just a few things that don't fit me properly. My head in the clouds, I don't know where we go. I feel like it's change love. fantasy here I am falling down crashing down and I feel like I don't need you here I am falling down deep inside and I feel like I don't need you Okay guys, I'm very happy with how it turned out. I really thought the rug was gonna be really big, but I think it's the perfect size for the dining area. When it was rolled up, it just looked like it was massive. Very happy with this purchase and it was only $39. I wasn't actually quite sure if the jute rug would go with the rest of the apartment because the other rugs that I have here are like colored and a bit like abstract kind of design, but I feel like it's okay. Hey guys, happy Saturday. It is actually quite late in the afternoon already. I think it's around 4.30. Nothing exciting really happened during the day. Carl did come over and helped me put the frames up on the wall here in the lounge room in my little entrance and in my bedroom. Also, I did a bit of DIY. It's actually drying right now, but let me show you around the apartment once again. So as you know, my DIY went on top of the TV. It doesn't look like it's a straight or in the middle in camera, but in person, I swear it is. Um, but yeah, this is how it's turned out. I'm very happy with how it looks. I feel like it flows in the lounge room. The camera also doesn't pick up the texture but um, yeah, you can really see it in person and it looks good. So I'm very happy. I hope that doesn't fall anymore because I don't want to deal with that 
ever again. And then in my little entry, this was supposed to be the study room, but I've made it as my entry hallway kind of thing. That was the print that we put up. And yeah, I don't think I've showed you this part of the apartment before, but this is what it looks like. I've got another mirror there, as you can tell. And then my shoes here, that Udi shouldn't be there. That should be in the laundry room. I wasn't actually quite sure about this clothes rack um, and how my bags look, but we'll just make do for now. Um, it doesn't look too bad, so I'll probably leave it like that for a while. And then lastly, the master bedroom. As you can tell, I have two prints up on this wall. I was thinking of putting it on top of the bed like in the other plays, but I don't know, I'm kind of vibing it there. Like when you walk in, you can see that straight away. So I've left it there. The other thing that I did today was this. I painted the legs on my old bedside tables. I think they're dry now, actually. Yes, they are. So I might put this back together and then I'll show you afterwards. Wow, okay, so this is it put back together. I like it. It definitely looks better than before. It was just plain white before. And now I feel like it's kind of similar to that shelf, even though they're not the exact same colors, but close enough. And then the other one, I just put it here in the little entrance underneath the frame. I don't really have a home for that yet, but I'm just going to keep that there for now. Also, this trolley is not mine. I borrowed that from a friend, so I'm going to return it to him tomorrow. But yeah, it's just going to stay there for now. Not too bad, right? Mm -hmm. 